Hey there guys, it's Kyle with the Whistle Realty team and we're here for a special episode of Santee Saturdays at the brand new Omelette Factory opening today. We're super excited, we're gonna sit down, talk to the owner Peter and learn all about the hot new location. Let's get to it. All right, Peter, thanks for joining me today. Pleasure, Carl. So we're here inside the new Omelette Factory. So tell us about what is the Omelette Factory first off and how did you guys end up in this new place? Well, the Omelette Factory goes back about 23 years. Uh, we opened in almost 23 years. We opened in 1994 at the west end of town and uh, um, 23 years almost later, here we are. Um, I would have never dreamt that we'd last this long, but thanks to our customers support and all the good help we have, uh, we survived. The change, it's going to be nice to go into a building that everything's going to be operating properly and, and clean and new. Um, the fact that uh, all the old staff will carry on over here and all the familiar faces will be there, all the family members will be working. Everybody that works for us is considered family to us. Um, we don't have customers here, we have guests. We treat them as family. Okay. It's uh, very important to us and I think that's why we've lasted for 23 years almost. What kind of food do you guys serve? We serve uh, breakfast and lunch. Okay. What are some of the, the real popular dishes on the breakfast side of things? Well, we do have a big variety of breakfasts. I mean, we have your standard bacon and eggs, ham and eggs, uh, chicken fried steak. Uh, we do a couple of uh, Mexican uh, dishes, uh, machaca. We do a huevos con chorizo, um, huevos rancheros. Uh, we offer um, some uh, uh, sweet items like pancakes. We do blueberry pancakes, chocolate chip pancakes. Uh, strawberry pancakes, the uh, same thing with the waffles, we do chocolate, I mean the uh, strawberry waffles or plain waffles. Okay. Uh, French toast, we do have uh, some combination of uh, either waffles with uh, eggs and bacon or French toast with eggs and bacon, so we do a, a nice little variety where they can have a few things. Um, we also uh, bake our own uh, biscuits here, so we have a, um, a pretty good biscuits and gravy uh, dish with uh, sometimes with eggs or it depends on how the customers order it and we also bake our own uh, blueberry muffins here too. Okay, and then tell me about the lunch menu. Uh, the lunch menu, we have a good variety of sandwiches, a club sandwich, Philly steak sandwich, uh, we do a gyro sandwich, uh, your standard uh, cold sandwiches, uh, roast beef, turkey, uh, BLP. Um, we have a couple of melts, uh, obviously the patty melt. Uh, we do a, a, a steak melt for special sometimes. We also do a beef melt, a turkey melt. Monday through Friday we make our soups. Okay. Um, from scratch. Okay. So being in a new location, you guys kind of get a fresh start. What are you guys going to do different here in the new location that people might be excited about? We don't want to change too much because uh, that's what has sustained us throughout the years is people coming in and getting uh, pretty much what they expect every time they walk in. Um, we are going to add a few uh, different things on the menu and experiment with some new dishes and uh, um, what we're going to add uh, to this location that we didn't have at the old location is the uh, beer and wine license that we're going to require. Um, we'll serve uh, low, uh, alcohol Bloody Marys and uh, mimosas, uh, champagne. Well, we get that asked a lot over at the other location, so hopefully we'll have it here. Very cool. That's exciting. Right. I think I know some people that might be happy about that. So what are you guys typical hours? Um, six to three, uh, seven days a week. Okay. Perfect. And then where is the new location at exactly? It is uh, just south of the Mission Gorge and Magnolia exit on Magnolia at 8860 North Magnolia. Okay. And if somebody wants more info on the Omelette Factory, where would they go? Uh, they could visit our website at uh, omelettefactory.com. Okay. So I know that there's another new addition to the restaurant out here in front. So tell us about that. Absolutely. That's something that uh, we wished we had at the old location for a long time. We'll have a patio over here that will accommodate uh, a uh, good, good amount of people and it's also going to be pet friendly. Okay. So they can bring their dogs if they want. Okay. Alright Peter, thanks for joining me. No Appreciate problem. it. Thank you. Thanks so much for joining us for this episode of Santee Saturdays. If you've enjoyed the video, we encourage you to like it, comment it, and more importantly share it so more people can learn about the new Omelette Factory in Santee. And if you own a local Santee business or run a community organization would like to be featured on a future episode of Santee Saturdays, give me a call, Kyle Whistle at 858-699-3895. Thanks so much for watching. See you next Saturday. We're going to sit down, talk to the owner, Peter, and learn about the hot new... Ah, that was good, too. All right.